So I'm here in the garage. I've made up stuff for the brick. It actually fits quite okay. As you can see here, there's plenty of space around the exhaust. And the new small turbo is yeah, maybe spinning later this evening. Yeah, it's actually looking quite all right. So I'm here, I want to say a big shout out to Jørgen for doing the intro and doing the thing. And as he said himself, he did a pretty good job, everything fits up really nicely. So turbo exhaust is okay, no boost pipe. Uh, I need to redo this fitting and I need to put it here and not this location. So uh, it's gonna be me and Lasse doing this, maybe tonight, maybe tomorrow. Um, I need to change my car lovers. I need. We talked about it being okay and everything, but uh, I sold my car lovers because there's a guy watching the video, and uh, he wanted to buy my car lovers, so he bought them, and uh, I have to get rid of them Friday. Um, so yeah, we're putting on the new car lovers already. But the car is firing up, as you just heard. It sounds pretty good. Uh, Last night, uh, for my followers on Instagram, they saw I was doing a test drive and uh, most things look like they were working. I think I might have an issue with the turbo, so I need to check everything because maybe this V-band needs to be tightened or something like that. Uh, it was a little bit, because there was a little bit of smoke coming out from that V-band, which is pretty strange. But um, otherwise than that, it's leaking a little bit of oil from the drain plug, so I think I need to. Take a look at that. <laughs> um, and maybe also from the drain plug from the transmission, but um, nothing crazy. Um, otherwise than that, it's wet. You can see it. Because I did, uh, you know, if it's snowing, you have to drive your car out and just lay it idle in the snow. That's, that's a thing. And my car's never been working, but it's working today. So, you know, last night it was spring and today it's winter. So hopefully it will be more spring tomorrow and after that even more spring. So we can actually go test drive. But uh, right now the most important thing is I need to borrow Tyson spacers again. Um, and I need to borrow a set of wheels. So if you have, uh, I need a set of Audi wheels. Um, and um, when I got all that together, I will bring the car to the dyno. Uh, whenever Jimmy has time, but uh, the thing is Jimmy is I think he's pretty busy because he hasn't gotten back to me with the time But uh, you know, I'm willing to wait for the best so not a problem for me But cars running Surprisingly enough uh, Haven't been any major issues and it's even running on the old plugs from last year. I'm I think I'm gonna change out the plugs. We're gonna do an oil change on the engine at some point, not right now, but at some point. So when that's done, um, maybe I put in, I'm going to put in a set of new plugs. So everything is nice and snug. And I also bought this really cool thing from Summit. Uh, you can get it from other places, I guess, but that's why I do also show me. This is actually for for the spark plugs that's, it is, that is hard to get at. I can actually show it to you uh, because I'm using like a wrench and it's really some of my plugs are pretty difficult to get at but this one it's kind of a, a spark plug extender you put it on and suddenly it's really easy to get at uh, and it's made in the USA 
which is great. But um, it's really easy. It's, now it's a breeze changing the plugs. So I actually considered at some point getting the exhaust redone just so it would be easy to get at the plugs. But um, that might just not be necessary. And also the new turbo is, uh, seems to be running fine. No major issues or anything. And it fits the hood and looks pretty really good in there. So, you know. If I was clever, I would remove this one and have like a turbo inlet here, but uh, I am not clever. I was thinking maybe we could cut away this area and maybe do something up into the hood, but I don't know. I don't know. It works. It works fine, I guess. I also need to... This has always been open, but I'm gonna try and if I can like make this seal so... This one gets more cooler in effect. The only thing I need to do is move the transmission cooler. Uh, I'm gonna put it in a different location so it hopefully works better and won't get uh, killed by tires. So that's like the next kind of small jobs. And also I need, you know, we've got the Danish flag over there. We need a flagpole holder in the car. So that's also a small job. But uh, things are working out. Oh, I need the horn. I actually got a horn, you know. Best build team horn you can get. Um, that needs to be attached also, so we can merp merp people. Um, but otherwise than that, everything's working. Um, of course, I fired the car up on gas I bought last year, so when I have to buy new gas, I'm probably gonna go broke. But um, hey, that's how it is. So I hope you like this little update. Uh, I don't know what to say anymore. But the next video is gonna be dino time, I hope. So... Yeah, stay tuned, and as always, to JC!